What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be playing How to Train Your Dragon in Minecraft. Now, I have played this mod before and let me just say it is an amazing mod. So, the first thing we're going to do is open our satchel because we have some goodies inside of it that we're going to take a little peek into. Oh, we got a Drake, Dragon Treat, and Dragon Orb. So dragon orbs are to store your dragons, dragon treats are to level them up and get them super big where you can shoot fireballs, and drakes are, well, dragons. So we're going to put all of our stuff here and we're going to start. So the first thing of doing a survival, let's play like this, is, well, you need to get the basics. You just won't be able to get any dragons whatsoever. So we're going to start with getting some wood. And if you guys like How to Train Your Dragon, which is the mod we are playing, then hit that like button because that would show me that you guys love How to Train Your Dragon, just like I do. So let's just craft some more sticks because apparently I didn't craft enough. But, you know, Minecraft is such a peaceful game. I love Minecraft's soothing music. Oh. But yeah, so first I think we're gonna sh start getting some like ores and stuff, honestly. I like to um, add all my like sticks together just to create one giant thing. Ooh, look, some crystals. I think this is part of the, oh wait, that's Thorncraft. So let's try to reach a like goal of um, 200 likes. 200 likes and I will create another episode of How to Train Your Dragon. Near you, except probably not near you. Cause I have no idea where you guys live. <gasps> look guys, a dragon nest over there. Oh. A dragon. A very first dragon. Okay, so... Honestly, it's kind of funny that we haven't seen many dragons. Because this whole thing is about dragons. Here, let me show you guys all the eggs. Real quick. Okay, so... Here are all the eggs. You have Arctic Lupus. Lupus. Whatever. Aztec. Be Bewilderbeast. Blaze Dragon. Blue Phoenix, Bow Snapper, Bow Snapper, Bow Snapper, Bow Napper, Catastrophic Quaken, and all these other things. All these other eggs, I should say. Frogon, Galaxy, Gladius, Grunkle, Light Fury, Night Fury, Nightbringer, Nada, Myth, Mummy. We have. Well, oh, Squirrel is a very powerful dragon. You have the Screaming Death, which is my favorite dragon. And my second favorite dragon is the Whispering Death. So yeah, and I just heard lava, because I think there's a lava patch somewhere across the waters. Let's break into this um, poor dragon nest. And look, you can see the dragon's wings flapping around. And there's the myth dragon. So majestic. We should go get a closer up on it, but first I'm going to seal this nest's coal. Why? Because I need coal. So I can progress. I hear flapping of wings. And this is a big vein of coal, even though it's a dragon's nest. Breaking in. Um. Hello. Okay. I'm just gonna go over here and take this, if you don't mind. And there we go, we got our first uh, dragon egg. Well, naturally. We kind of got this drake egg from a satchel. So you could also hatch dragons, because... Really, what's the point of a dragon mod pack if you can't hatch dragons? It's like, like peanut butter in a jelly sandwich. Why do they call it peanut butter and jelly if there's no jelly? You know? You know what? You speak of it what I speak of it? Anyways, let's craft two furnaces. It just some. It doesn't really matter. And let's collect some of this coal. Now we're gonna split this off using right click. And now we're just gonna add this. Up, oh, up, oh, there we go. So while that's cooking in the hot bakery of a furnace, we're just gonna take a quick look at this myth dragon. So you can see that you have this myth dragon. Some of these dragons might not be in How to Train Your Dragon, but they're still cool. So you have this cute little dragon that's eyeing me, and you have a tot. I don't know if that's a tot, honestly. It's a female, apparently. And it's a myth. It's a carnivore as well, which is pretty cool. You know, maybe if we get lucky, maybe we could get a very own Night Fury, Light Fury, Screaming Death, Bewilderbeast, and 
what is the other one called red death now i've never gotten a screaming death uh red death well there's a lot of deaths i never got one of those two i got i never got one of those two dragons but i could tell you they're pretty cool i watched a few videos on this mod pack and this mod pack is sick well, some might say. I don't know if everyone would think it's cool, but yeah. Okay, so now that we got iron tools, we could start progressing a little bit. And we could also see how to craft stuff here. I wonder if they have stone armor. I don't think so. Yeah, definitely not. So I think whenever you see a level 100 dragon, that means there's a nest nearby. Ooh, Arctic. That means we could get a Crimson Gore Gunner, which I don't know. I guess it's classified as a as a um, legendary or just a myth. Oh, guys, it's a Yeti. 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 Yeti boom. <gasps> Yay! I got a Santa hat. Oh look, that's the Crimson Gore Gunner right there. So, depending on that size, I would say that there's a nest about around here. And what is that? What is that in the distance? Ice spike spy. It's pretty cool if you ask me. So, now that we are here in the ice spike spy, I guess we could start looking for the dragons in here. Now there's many different types of dragons and I know we're not going to be able to get all of them in one episode. But yeah, the Rainbow Army. That's that's what I'm calling you guys from now on, the Rainbow Army. Hi, Penguin. Bop. Ooh! Lamppost. I don't know why I'm so excited about it. Lamppost. Apparently I have to use an axe. Axe? I have a lamppost! And that's also just a... What is that? Oh, it's a floating island. I forgot that this floating islands and this that contain slime. Oh my gosh, that contain slimes. That if you eat the um, slime balls, then you get like effects. But you do get slowed a lot. Yay! Lamp post. Now my lamp post. I'm gonna smack you with a lamp post. Your hey, lamp posts are super powerful. They're like a wizard wand. Magic. 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 Okay, yep, let's advance and I'm also getting shot by skeleton. Ow! Oh wait, that's a stray pop. Oh, yep, that's definitely a stray. The drumsticks. I need to eat more food so I can grow more drumsticks in my stomach. That's how Minecraft works. If you eat bread, then you, it equals on um, drumsticks, apparently. Yeah, I don't really understand that. But, yeah. Because it is what it is. Oh! Well, there's definitely a creeper after me. Help. I'm getting attacked. And oh my god, what? Whoa. From one block, I broke two. That doesn't make much sense. But it's Minecraft, so everything makes sense. I think we're gonna have to go into this forest. Honestly. Oh, I've spoken too soon. I see a village house, it looks like. Wait. Ah! The spooders are after me. Hang on, now I lost where I was going. I think I was going this way. Cause I could see on my mini map. Wait, is that a Christmas house? Eh. Needless to say, I'm still going there. Eh. The yetis are after me. I can't. I need to go faster. I need to zoom. Wait. Is this where the reindeer dragon is? Cause the. Oh my, <gasps> the reindeer dragon. Wow, we found it. We found Rudolph. This is where Rudolph's offspring is born. Ooh, toy soldier. I'll take that. Oh wait, effective tool axe. Yum. Anything in here? Ooh, anvil. Anvils would be great. I just had some. Excuse me, are you paying your rent? He doesn't like me saying that. You can't come in here. Oh, no. oh my gosh, I didn't notice how much wheat was in this room. I got my pickaxe swinging from side to side. I think he's gone. 
Have you paid your rent, sir? Excuse this oh iron block. Okay, I'm sorry sir, but I'm good. Well, I died. And um yeah. Oh well. There you go. Okay, we have 45 pieces of bread, so that should hold us over until we find a village. A meteorite struck thy earth. And from it came a volcano! I don't know why there's lava around here. Okay, I see you guys moving. Whoa! Hello, deadly Nada. You like this? And I'm riding a horse. This horse is shaking its head no very vigorously. What? Ow! Wait, does this Santa hat give me protection? Wow. Oh, I think this is a clang nest. Hello. Yeah, I've seen a clang fly over. I've seen this clang fly over there and come and teleport back. Ow! Looks like that clang don't have a nest. I guess anything that flies in the air doesn't have a nest. Hi. Wow, you're so realistic. Look at that. Whoa, I'll feed you some. Oh, you're shooting your brother. Or your sister. Wait. Oh, that's a female. And I like the clang nest because the clang nest has a lot of iron. You could get a full iron set just from the clang nest. It's really nice. Polish Dandesite. Go! Uh, I guess I'll need some obsidian. And boom! So now we can mine until our heart's desire. So, now that we got all this iron, I think I should just leave a little gift. And that's a thick gronkle. I think I should leave a gift. I will be giving you this iron egg to thank you on my journey. Because when you get iron, you basically are going to complete the game. So, you got the iron egg, and you're welcome, Mrs. Clang. Also, here's a piece of coal. Do, wait, do you like coal? Yep. Oops. Don't need all my coal. Oh no. Okay, I got it. I'm getting stomped on by a Clang. You know, there's a lot of nests in the plains by him, so I think we will be able to find quite a few nests here. Well, I don't know if th there's many dragons that live in the plains by him, because I guess you could say it's like the default of all biomes, if you would say that. But yeah, so me and my Santa hat, <coughs> oh, Christmas is in the 40s. So me and my Santa hat are just um, gonna like travel, la uh, tra travel around and see if we could spot anything out here in the wild Amazonian forest. You have the wild Santa Rainbow Man and he is, oh, look at that. I think that might be a light fury, but it's flying so high up I don't think it has a nest. Cause you remember that clang? I think it flew so far from its nest. Oh, well, no man. I think it flew so far from its nest that it had to get teleported back. Yes, teleported. And also there's a Drake nest over there, but I already have a Drake egg from that satchel that I opened earlier. And yeah, you know what guys? I think it's time. I think here I will set up my house. Even though you guys probably don't want to see all that boring stuff. And also, how do I make a lava incubator? So we need a lot of obsidian and a lava bucket. It's kind of going to be hard to get since we need diamonds to mine obsidian. But yeah. Is that cool or is that... I really hope that's cool. Oh wait, they have obsidian here. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, there's an army of them. I'm sorry. You guys look very nice, but you're not nice at all. Ow! I'm defending against these boys. With a custom fancy animation. Are they just gonna keep spawning? Drake, help me. Whoa, no, 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 no. I don't wanna lose where I am. And why is this Drake circling me? It's kinda scary. Oh no, oh no, I need to run, run. 
but I ain't playing around mo no more. Okay, maybe I am. Okay, so now that we um exterminated um the aliens, poor aliens, we are going to be baking some of these some of this obsidian. Well, that's if you find diamonds here. I doubt it, but you never know. And this is very dangerous. Fire right next to that isn't the best idea, but there's water flowing into it, so I guess it's okay. And yeah, this looks like a pretty good place to build our home. And these aliens are still chasing me, weirdly. Maybe I should make my house on top of the medium. Oh, I found it. I got it. Ow. I found the other spawner of the aliens. You guys, I'm sorry, but you guys are like a problem. And I don't want to be like rude or anything, but you guys need to go. Maybe I could drop an anvil on them. And that doesn't seem humane. Anyways, I think we should stop making my house here because, well, it may be just like a little nest because you need to get a nest, uh, well, just a house overall. I'm gonna call it a nest though. And there's an alien heading towards me. There's actually a few. Bleh, bleh. That's what they say, they say bleh. So let's clear out the lands, the lands. Let's place for things like this. Now we're just gonna extend it out by two. One. Two and two and two and two and two and two. Okay, so now we have this. Now it's gonna make this. Uh, let's make this. If you guys enjoyed this video, tell me. Wait, but first, before we end the video, I have to place all me eggs down. Ah! You have to show your eggs off to your enemies. Even though I don't have any enemies except green aliens that keep coming from the meteor. Are they gone? I think they're gone. So we're gonna just add some, I guess you can see spikes, I don't know really what I'm making here, but that's okay because in life you don't always need a plan to make something beautiful. Isn't that right? That's right. All right, and boom. Well, we have our little home, I guess. It's not really much, but yeah, these are gonna be, this is gonna be the wall for you guys. The iron wall for you guys. I'm using my iron to create the iron wall. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed my video, and I will see you in another one. Peace.